Okay, hey guys, so today is October 24th. Um, it is, what time is it? It's like, it has to be like 6 o'clock. Yeah, it's 6.10. Mm, so, it's been a hard couple past weeks, not gonna lie. Typically the vlogs that go up every Sunday are recorded the week prior. And for the past two vlogs, we've been recording it like for the past two vlogs as in like the one that's going to be going up today which is going to be tomorrow because it's saturday right now um those have all been filmed to like the day before it's so like we're in florida and it's been really really overcast for like the past like week or so and that kind of just like knocks off anything florida like that you can like really do um so there hasn't been a much of Florida stuff yet. It's like we want to go to the beaches and show you guys some of like our favorite like beach spots and all of that kind of jazz, but it's literally just not been the weather for that. So what we were planning on doing today was um, we were gonna go get like some pumpkins and probably go to like one of the pumpkin patches. We wanted to take Tegan. But, um, one of the pumpkin patches that everybody goes to in this town is called, like, Farmer Mike's You Pick, and it's, it's really cute, like, basically everybody goes there and they, like, all take pictures, um, because they have, like, a cute little setup that they put up and everything, but they don't allow dogs. We were looking into going to this one off of Mockley Road in Naples, and they typically allow dogs, but apparently yesterday there was some kind of altercation, and when we called today to check to make sure that Tegan could go, they were like, no, we had an issue yesterday. We're just not allowing it. They're only letting little dogs go now if like they're picked up. So Tegan wasn't able to go and do any of that stuff. We really wanted to because she has her Instagram page and we really wanted to get her some pictures with the pumpkins because it would be so cute. We brought her home on Halloween last year. So she's our little Halloween baby. So I have the cutest little pictures of her when she was just a little chicken nugget with of the pumpkins in front of our house. I'll insert that here. Chris will insert there. Um, and then I just kind of wanted to like remake the picture, but what we'll just do is probably we'll just have to buy some pumpkins and bring them here for her to be able to do her picture here. So yeah, that's kind of why like we woke up really late today to begin with. We got like a super late start because we had a later night last night. So we just didn't get around to doing that. And now it is super, super overcast again. And the sun's gonna be going down in an hour here anyways. So we wouldn't really have like the cutest place to go film a, um, like what we wanted to do was we wanted to carve pumpkins and kind of do a, like a little get to know me where we were going to answer like some questions so people could get to know me and Chris better. <laughs> Tegan and Chris are playing. <laughs> and also Tegan just like had like a coughing attack, crying when she was coughing. And I don't know, like literally it happened out of nowhere. Like I don't even know the last time I heard her even. And we gave her some honey and it literally stopped right after that. Okay, hey guys. So we have decided that we are going to carve a pumpkin and we picked out um, like our, our stencil, I guess, even though we're not gonna use a stencil, but we found our muse and we're gonna do just one pumpkin. Yeah, yeah we're yeah, just gonna do one pumpkin, pumpkin cause it's probably gonna be a decent bit of work, we'll see. But we are not going to tell you guys yet what it is. We're just going to show you at the end. I'm really excited for it. It's, it's right up our alley. We are just going to go to the grocery store that is like right down the street to pick up a pumpkin. So, yep, we will catch you inside of Publix. <laughs> okay, guys, so we got the goods. We will see you when we get back to the RV. All right, guys, so we're going to not show you. Yeah, probably. We're not gonna show you what our pumpkin is gonna be until we complete the project. So, we're just gonna start with the basics right now. Chris is gonna go ahead and cut the hole in the top and then we'll be scooping out the guts. Oh, no, oh, no. Okay, so what was the last um, TV show that you binge watched? 
The Haunting of Bly. Is it Bly? Bly Manor, yeah. Bly Manor. Tegan, what do you got? She's eating something. Back. That's all the gooey gooey's out. Yeah, and then I was also, I also like recently binge watched on my own um, the Emily in Paris. I thought it was just so cute. It was so like fluffy, feel good kind of um, TV show. It was exactly, I feel like, what a lot of people needed in this whole 2020 quarantine weird times that we're living in kind of thing. touched up and I never want to go get a touched up. <laughs> How old were you when you had your first celebrity crush and who was it? Yeah, I don't would have been either. I didn't... You never had a celebrity crush? Not really. My celebrity crush was Jesse McCartney. Yeah. I was freaking obsessed with him. But like, I was a bit older. I mean, I was obsessed with Britney Spears when I was like five. But what's one thing that can instantly make your day better? Good news. Any kind of good news. Yeah, any kind of good news for sure. But if I'm having just like a bad day, like a nice dinner will like, yeah, like having a nice dinner will literally like turn my whole day around. <laughs> 